The increase in taxes decreases the demand for goods and services. Therefore, the ice curve will shift to the left. The demand for goods and services decreased, therefore the ice curve shifts to the left. At a given interest rate, say 10%, we move from this equilibrium point to this equilibrium point. But how does point B compare to point A? Well, we know the interest rate did not change, so there was no change in the interest rate. Taxes increased, and this increase in taxes led to the decrease in demand for goods and services. So taxes was higher. The increase in taxes led to a lower demand for goods and services. So that is lower. And the lower demand for goods and services led to a lower level of production. So Y is also lower. Consumption spending and investment spending is a function of the level of production. Therefore, C will also be lower and investment spending will also be lower. In this case, taxes change. Nothing has happened to government spending. So we have no change in government spending.